Hello guys, back with another firework video. So what I have here is um, part of my Golden Lion uh, fireworks collection. So again, so once when I started um, collecting fireworks, um, these are some of the first pieces that I gathered when I started collecting. Um, luckily enough, I managed to get all of them in in one go. Like I'd expect, like now that. Trying to be able to find one of these pieces every now and again. Somebody wants to get rid of part of their collection, but they're such nice fireworks that I wouldn't be getting rid of these anytime soon. Um, so yeah, uh, these were downstairs in my cellar, which I brought out um, to show somebody. Uh, lucky enough, um, I did take them out because they were in a box and the box had got uh, a bit wet, damp, and it completely rotten away. But luckily inside the box these were stored nicely in some plastic uh, bags so they came away un un unscathed really. Um, so what had happened is where I pushed the boxes in my cellar to make room for other boxes I think they'd maybe like nudged the little water mains down there and got like a, they might have, like some of the water might have spilled out at some point. Um, yeah, and that box had just got ruined, so what I've done now. Luckily, like, I checked all everything else, and everything else seems seems fine, but as extra precaution, even that some of, some of the, my selection boxes that are, like, they, they're wrapped in cellophane, I thought I'll just bag them up as well, just to be extra safe, you know. You know, you're always safer if you bag up. <laughs> um, yeah, so let's get into them. I've got this uh, crisscross crabs after sweet corn. What I love about Golden Lion is their packaging that's why i collect all their selection boxes and i don't really collect cakes um i've, I've only got really I've, I've got a few cosmic cakes uh, i've got quite a few cube cakes now um just because i really respect the cube brand what they i guess they uh when they came out on the market they were just like that that bit better than everything else made everyone else raise their game um, just the history they have so yeah that's why I collect cube but I'm more of a selection box and rocket man so I don't have too many cakes but I've got this one crisscross criss -cross crabs after sweet corn uh, let's see if it, it's got the effects so 38 shot rum and candle ejecting orange palms with crackle stars colour strobe stars shooting one by one from side to side and last three lines with fan shape performance. Yeah, just a, just a really nice, nice packaging on these. Um, usually, like a packaging doesn't bother me. Like I, some people don't like, say, the Celtic or the Vivid and or the uh, Evolution. They say they're a bit boring. I quite like those those sorts of packaging. I'm not too keen on artwork. So the the Vivid ones, like they've done for their Barrage packs, um, I, d I don't really like them, I prefer the, the all black vivid and, and their new design that they've got, so their new designs that, that, that they've got uh, is alright but I don't like their barrage packs, um, but I do like these golden lion ones, uh, yeah that's the crisscross crepes after sweet call. Moving on to this one, Contented Two Hump Camelin Oasis, so they've got all really unique unusual names, big up whoever named them. And this one, apart from a brilliant packaging, it also shows the effects on the back. So it's a V-cake, 36 shots of ejecting bursts of lemon blue stars and crackling stars. Yeah, this one, I think it's a bit like of a, quite a slow paced cake. It's not, not probably their best one actually, out of the Golden Lion cakes, but it's just, look, just the packaging, I love it, isn't it? So that's that. And then last of all, out of these Golden Lion trio of fireworks that I brought out, the happy monk jumps over the wall, just like my favourite out of the munch for the packaging. This one doesn't read the effects on it, unfortunately. Um, I can't remember what they do actually. I've read it somewhere what it does. Uh, I've never seen actually this one fired. I've seen these two, but not this one. So probably the only way I will see it fired is if I fire this one. But there's a fat chance of that happening. Um, yeah, so that's the. Happy Monk jumps over the wall.
So when I actually got these three fireworks, um, I also at the same time uh, got delivered this one here, this uh, Cosmic Sputnik Spinning Fountain. So much like the, uh, the Spinning Lotus by Zeus, this was just the same firework done quite a few years ago. So yeah, there's, there's a couple of versions of this. There's one that's all silver, I believe. There's this one here with this packaging, I don't know. Um, they're just different years, I think. Don't know which one came earlier, probably like the silver one, I'd, I'd imagine. Yeah, it's just on a wooden base, and then it just spins round. Um, and this one here, it does read the effects as well. I think it's got sparks and fl flames, isn't it? Or let's say, emits shower sparks and emits coloured flames. Combination firework, combination fountain. No, garden firework, combination fountain. There's Captain Cosmic. <laughs> Yeah, so this is like an unusual piece. Comes with a box as well that, that protects it. Unfortunately, that box is mash up, and I think that's because the <coughs> just the way it was stored. I think somehow when when it been uh, placed in the in storage, this was like underneath these, and then the box rotted, so like it just like got squashed, I guess. But still, the firework's intact, so not too worried about that. Would have been nice if this was intact, but that's a minor, as long as the fireworks like sound. Yeah, so that's these lot, which pretty unbelievable if you think, got them all at the same time. And the one good thing about the person I got these off is I kept in contact and managed to acquire quite a few pieces off the guy. Um, met through the firework forum, actually got a few pieces waiting to be uh, collected at some point. Um, which are going to be really good. Can't wait to put them online for you all to see. And then, if you look at the video that I just uploaded, the Columbia box, it was this guy here that actually got into contact with another forum member, um, telling them that I was after the NG boxes, and he, and he shortly, soon after, contacted me, and that's how I got the Columbia box. And then we just remained friends ever since. Got a few other pieces, like the Space Barrows box, and some others, yeah, so... That was really good.